Hello guys, today I'll be showing you how to uh, how to get custom assets on Flash Team. Yesterday I taken a look at Flash Team. Today is going to be a little different because we'll be importing custom assets from Rapper Offline. We're gonna pull custom assets from Rapper Offline in Flash Team. So if you click on here, it will open the Rapper Offline logo. Um, sure. For this demonstration, I'm going to uh, uh, demonstrate how to get this shirt so yes yeah, so this shirt in in flash team so you must have wrapper offline 2.0 and 2.1 for this tutorial because it does not work without these versions and uh, it says upper underscore body underscore atom underscore 0 dot 2 2 0 2 2 so to do that I have wrapper offline 2.0 so resources app uh, server store uh, CC underscore store a family uh, upper underscore body or lower underscore you can take any folder you want um, here it says Adam underscore 022 so it says 022 so let me look for 022 here we go this is the 022 and it has all these uh, actions and uh, all these stuff so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna copy this folder um, just for demonstration I'm gonna show you how to create a folder here um, just go to go to the new folder and just type it uh, import of FP which stands for flash team store desired assets here and make sure you right click it you right click um, click winrar and click add to all tabs now if you did that you're going to it will bring you to this screen just say a zip format because flash themes allows a zip format to be uploaded not uh, rars or weird format now we have it in zip now we're gonna go to the flash teams website go to your dashboard go to your dashboard of flash teams go to flash themes dot net slash dashboard flash hash main okay now what we're gonna do is we're in this page right just go to the assets section and uh, you're going to see this new page now the it says asset upload your assets should be in a zip file remember that you put one in asset folder otherwise it will not work so select a theme, there are a variety of themes, you can choose comedy world, a theme, show you a custom a sh shirt, uh, 022 or whatever, whatever you can call it, but I'm just going to say 022. It is going to be, the type is going to be the upper underscore body, not the lower underscore body. Type it designates, so just say upper body, and uh, Adam, body type is Adam. Publish is no. Uh, you can designate with publishment, but I don't publish this asset file. Select the file. I'm going to upload this one. The folder must be as designated. Click upload. And it says success. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to disable this designated. Now it is published. So click on publish. Um, I think it's not published. So it looks like we've imported a custom shirt. So let's see the effect here. Uh, we're going to create a character right now. And for this a theme, I'm going to select Tommy. Well, make sure your character creator is set to 2016. First, it will take you to the CC browser. It's just like the original Bologna app site. Um, uh, I pulled this XML off from Rapper Offline. Even this one I pulled off from Rapper Offline. Click on Adam uh, on Flash Themes uh, Character Creator. It's going to take you to this page right here Flash Themes logo. And your shirt has been uploaded successfully. Now you can. You can see custom assets export. I've already did the same thing for like the hair as well. I also did the upload the hair earlier. If you can see this custom hair, and you have to spoof the ID. If you want in wrapper offline, if you created it, if you throw it in here, well, that's for another separate video. Or maybe should I do it in this video? I'm going to create uh, an atom that is designated with this guy, and then click save. Um. After you save, I'm going to just save this guy and then I'm going to go into the wrapper offline directory. Um, just
just go to the resources app uh, underscore assets and find the newest XML file. Make sure it is about XML. All right, so let's try to upload it. It does not work. So if you click on create, um, if you click on a create or whatever, if you click uh, create a character right now, if you click on upload, you can see the asset does not upload because this error message will come up. We see the character file has invalid components. I have a, I have a fix for this small problem. Make sure you spoof the ID. If you spoof the ID and upload it, you will be accurate. So it says Adam Upper Body two four six three zero three eight. So we have to type that designated ID. So what I'm gonna do is open this one and click on edit with notepad I'm going to edit this with notepad and what I'm gonna do is look for this asset 2463038 so okay upper body for just say I'm just gonna type 022 because earlier I remember let's go to down down this line and you can see the id is just adam underscore 022 just don't set the adam 022 just hide this and type the designated id 2463038 if it for like the hair or the other parts you can spoof the id pretty easily you can just find it in notepad Two four six three zero three eight. Yes, that's accurate. Two four six three zero three eight. Now we're going to go back here, back to this page. Just click create here. Um, now we're going to upload the XML, and then it's going to work, baby. It will really work, and this is a very useful tutorial because um, if you did if you did everything right, it would work. See, it works. It works. It really works. Um. I haven't known, not many uh, Go animators known you can pull uh, this character is imported all the way back in Rapper Offline. Is now on Flash Themes. Hell yeah. I even did the same thing with the hair also, um, which I had this custom hair pulled off. And uh, I haven't published it, but uh, I only published the hair alone. But make sure you press no if you're trying to publish things. Okay, now we have custom assets on flash themes any theme any binary you set make sure asset id must be correct so that it will work it will really work trust me it worked for the hair and now it works for the shirt i hope you like this video that's practically it for flash themes tutorials i hope you like this video if you like the channel and subscribe next video i'll show you how to create an account on flash themes many people don't know much but i'll show you the process on how so I hope you liked this video. If you liked it, comment, like, and subscribe to you. Then it's World Animator. I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.